Hey, what is up, everybody? This is Steve Breach coming to you here with Stock Talk for today on Wednesday. Um, pretty boring day here, honestly, uh, looking at the market today. Um, we started out, you know, down, but it looked like it was going to be a pretty good day. Uh, we finished the day down $200. Um, honestly, you know, we've had some really good weeks here um, looking over the uh, portfolio and uh, to have two down weeks is all right. I mean, at one point, I had my portfolio up over 50% um, profit. Uh, right now, we're sort of eating away at it. We could keep dropping $100 here, $200 here. Um, the market's up 18.82%. Um, on the stuff that we put in there, honestly, most of my stuff was down today. I only had four positive stocks. Uh, we had Nike uh, making 22 cents, WWE making 35 cents. Uh, ERI, the stock that never quits going up, uh, was up almost 6%. Two dollars and forty-four cents. I don't know how much longer to hold that one on for. That one's uh, we bought it fifteen. Um, it's sitting at forty-three twenty-three right now. It's up two hundred and twenty-three percent. You know, I, I don't know. I guess we just hold it until we see the bubble burst and and, and get out of it at that point. But that that was a stock that honestly somebody just walked up to and told me it work, and I just bought it right off the uh, the line. I think that at one point it was down to like fifteen dollars when I bought it. And in the past, it's been like a $60 stock. If I, I'm, that's off the top of my head, just dreaming there. But um, Penn um, was up today, 73 cents, 2%, uh, bringing that one to, uh, shoot, where is that? 32.44. Remember, that one was uh, at 40, uh, like, like a week or two weeks ago. So we're building to get back up to that. Um, yesterday, I talked about we bought four stocks. CLSN, I'm gonna have to move this over because I'm gonna have to switch screens. CLSN today, that's that, uh, I believe, a cancer treatment drug um, I bought yesterday. That one went to the freaking moon, but I think it went so high that so many people cashed out on it early, even though we're still waiting uh, for the uh, test results to come back in July. Uh, July is when we're hoping to really for the bubble to get big on this bad boy. Um, its high point today was at $6.44, but at the end of the day, it fell all the way to 4 25 uh, to finish down on the day but uh, I think that was honestly people that had been on it uh, longer than me I bought this one yesterday um, not even on the 11th this stock was three dollars um, so you know this one's I've been riding high this week um, so I think that honestly people who had bought it are cashing out on it and then when it goes down they're gonna you know re-up on it and then just uh, push that percentage just take that profit percent out right there so um that that one did really well um cody c-o-t-y the kim kardashian stock that one was down four percent today mgm one that i really do believe in that one was down 1.71 down 33 cents um you know when you're taking a wash on basically every single stock that you have in your portfolio um Days like this are going to are, are going to come up. I, I believe in these stocks. Like I said yesterday, I can hold these guys in, until I'm 90 uh, and be okay. I know some of the stuff that I've been holding up at portfolio that have done really well for me. Eri up 223 percent. Um, Save Spirit Airlines up 81 percent. Um, Expa uh, that one were up 76 percent. But that one. I'm keeping my eye on it's down for the second day in a row, down 50 cents this time, down 10%. Um, you know, I've got a good deal of profit built up in that one. Uh, I bought that, I think I put 100 bucks into it. Um, so I don't want to see all the profits drop on that bad boy. But, uh, you know, um, it had a pretty good day the other day. And uh, it's sort of been kitten on since then. Expo is, is like little spas that are inside airports. Um, and they started doing Corona testing, I guess, because there's so many people traveling in and out of there. And that's the reason why we picked that one up. Um, they, they got one airline, JFK, um, that was announced that they pick up more. Uh, maybe that'll be bigger for that company. So we'll see if that is uh, Norwegian. Been down. I was going to watch that one. If that one fell below 10%, um, I was ready to pounce on that one. We're down in 1914. Um, but that is a Sorry, that's a stock. Uh, I'm, I'm up 67% on that bad boy. So I'm um, still got a lot built up into that one. And Penn, um, because of the fact that I bought early, but then I reinvested when it was when it was up, 
uh, when I got that bonus from work, that one uh, overall of what I've put into it is up 31%. So um, those are the ones that I'm, I'm riding high on there. WWE, I remember when I bought that, my buddy Mike laughed at me, up 30%. Um, from buying that one early so um, we'll see I got some other stuff in there that I really believe in um, it's gonna pay off down the road so it is what it is um, these down days when you see the reds if, if you're sitting there questioning um, what you're gonna do this is the time that you want to buy in who knows how many more down days we're gonna have some people think that the corona is coming back again and you know maybe it'll go back down to those March prices um, but I really don't believe that so you're gonna get it in sooner or later if you got any questions shoot me a text or a uh, tweet, I guess, and uh, we'll get a good ball rolling from there. Peace out, guys.